All right, guys, here we are from the trailer reaction. Today we're reacting to the trailer for the movie Gremlin. I don't know anything about this movie, but it has a, a single still of this, like, box that looks almost like the box from Hellraiser, Hellraiser. box. Yeah. Okay, I was, I was going to say. So, like, Gremlin, I love Gremlins. It's got nothing to do with Gremlins. But Hel a box, I love Hellraiser. That's a Hellraiser box. So you've already, you've already, you've already made me optimistic walking into this. Yeah, so I'm we'll already, presume I'm that Gremlin open lives to... in the box or something. Sure. And, and, and it comes out and raises hell. Probably. Let's check it out. So the effects are a little janky, but the premise of that I really like. The premise is great, but yes, I'm very. <clears throat> I feel like the only like, why would you call this gremlin? It doesn't like it doesn't look like a gremlin I know, but again, you can't be like that's not what real gremlins look like. I don't know what gremlins. No, are. I just feel like I don't know. Of all the things to call it, like maybe it's been so long that they're like, no one will get confused. It's fine. It looks like something that would be in Hellboy. Yeah. Um, but I like this idea. So the, so the premise is the idea you is have this cool. box. The box has a timer, and it will open up eventually. And you have to pass it to someone you love, or else I imagine it will, it doesn't doesn't stick, and it still comes for you. Um, yeah, or like yeah, and and when you give it to someone that you love, it like resets the timer. I don't know how in the beginning he's giving it to that other old you know old lady. Does he love her? Like what's going on? This is grandma, I think. And if we love each other, then can't we just give it back and forth all day? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Well. Or the timer? Did they ever say the timer resets? Is it just like musical chairs and you just get? It might killed? be like hot potato, and someone just does die. Do it before the timer runs out. Because he because he says to the grandmother, "Give it to someone else before the timer runs yeah. out." Now that doesn't that, that doesn't specifically mean it will reset. All right. Uh, and that's that's super creepy. And it makes me. I always try to put myself in these positions. So like, you have one of these boxes. And it, assume it's not a thing where it's like, well, I'm more physically capable than this person, so I'll take it because I can maybe fight this thing. Assume it's just you die. Would you give it to somebody? Oh, that's a horrible question. Yeah, I, I know. know. Would you? Because, like, you know that they could give it to somebody too, but I don't know. Like, would you want to live badly enough to, like, make someone you love die? And then – I'd be like, give it to someone you love that I hate. Because well here like here's the issue is that like just by giving it to somebody else, uh, doesn't assure that they're going to be able to give it to somebody else too. Yeah, without it, knowing the so exact by, rules, it kind of hampers act me a little bit. you're giving it to dies. Oh well, then that's ridiculous. Yeah. No, no, like they're not 100 percent going to die, but you have to be prepared because that, that because that is the worst case happen. scenario, yeah. no matter how the rules work. Yeah. Exactly, and uh, I don't know. So like you could think about like an older loved one, because like you know like well they've had a longer life than me, but then it's like well does that mean they should die? Yes. And, like, if you have, like, like that guy gave it to, his, like, that grandmother, she's, like, 80-something years old. She's, like, so I, like, I think in in the hospital dying or whatever. So actually, I'm, she looks so younger as I watch it again, but... I'm not clear about this, because he's got the box again now, but someone already died, and it wasn't him, because I guess he gave it to her or something. He was, like, it's going to come out to kill you, but I'll kill it, and then, he, you know, he didn't do it or something, and then he gives it to someone else. I so took like, it as that woman that was in the wheelchair... Uh, he took it from her because it seemed like she was like, that was very nice. You didn't have to do that. Right. And because uh, like, she's probably dying anyway. Yeah. But it looked like when it came out, it killed a lot of them or whatever. I know. So I'm, I'm like, how does it work? Does it kill everyone in the household? Because that, that's cheating. No, I'm somewhat confused about the rules. But, you know, the, you know, the fact that I'm interested in the rules is like uh, – and actually because we have the trailer you know, looping on mute here because um, the effects were really – a problem for me when I first watched. They're it. actually growing um, on me as not as bad as. Isn't that weird? Thought. Yeah, is it that is happening weird. to you too. I, it is. I think it's because we're watching without sound or something, but. But like, yeah. isn't that strange? So without sound, which means the visual aspect is the only part that matters. I don't find it as bad as when I found when I watched it with sound. And maybe it's just because it's the first I, time. It I might had a be the, expectation. the repeated. Yeah. Well, because you know, in a lot of these things, and like we're we're both I think kind of old school, where it's sort of like the Jaws thing or, or like the Alien thing, where it's like, don't show the fucking thing. Well, the Make only, the only it don't whatever, show right? it if it's not good. Well, so if, if you have something yeah. that's really good, I want to see it all day. Uh, like, like, like Placid, like for an example. Like, like, and granted, that's a thing that exists, so like you didn't have a lot to fuck up there. Yeah. I want to see a lot of Crocodile. Like, I, want, I want that shit. I mean, um, you can see it a lot at a certain point, but I feel like in the, in, 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 in the first act of the movie and in the trailer, I don't really want to get a great look at your thing. I kind of yeah, want to be yeah. intrigued by it. To some degree, I want to see like a little kid's drawing of it yeah. and like things like that. Yeah, right, like like, yeah, like like show me your kid's drawing of like the Baba Duke, bye bye man, whatever, conjuring bad, whatever. Right, do something sure. like that. Show me an ancient. Uh, we found this ancient book in the library, and it's like a painting of like the demon, and he's doing this. 
Um, no, this is weird. I don't know. Like a lot. Like so. Like when when it was playing with sound, I was like, oh, this acting's horrible too. So I was like, that was sort of like a downer for me, or like um, like. You know, like the delivery of the lines felt really, really bad. Nothing felt bad though on the par with like you know a B horror movie. It all felt fine for me. I didn't, I didn't dismiss any of it. The for one, the, acting the one dad who I think is going to be the main character really rubbed me the wrong way. I was like, I hate everything the about the you. Yeah, he's like the dude who's like, come on, I'm gonna pack the fire. Yeah, he's he's not good, but know. like. I could, it may like, be great fun. acting is not like a thing that runs parallel with a lot of horror movies. Yeah. Um, but the concept again, like, I have to keep coming back to that. Where like I'm like I want to know more about yes. this. I like the idea. Um, and that's what's for me. Uh, I'm a person that really puts myself in the position of the main characters. And so there's a lot of yeah. horror movies that I like that I think people go like that's not that's not good. But I'm like, well, have you thought about being in that guy's position though? That's, Why does that make it enjoy fuck. you? Oh, uh, it's just it's just something that like I do where I like I can get creeped out by the concept. Like yeah, like one of my the, like and uh, a lot of people don't like it. The Descent I find one of the scariest movies. I've never ever. seen that, so I can't comment. I, it, it's just the I idea like that's of like being a cult, in that position. Uh, I'm like that's the movie. scariest fucking thing you could be in. Just a uh, confined space with something that it like it's his element. I'm like that's horrifying. No, well, no spoilers for for the descent. I haven't seen it. Uh, if you saw uh, the trailer, they're they're splunkers. Right, they're they're splunking and there's a uh, weird cavemen. Yeah. Not cavemen, cavemen. Yeah. Yeah. No, I just I uh, fucking I don't know. Like um I I think most people put themselves in the position of like what if that was after me? That's like a normal thing to do. Um I've used that as my argument for defending a lot of movies though and like once once you like address someone who shits on something in that yeah. regard, they're usually a little bit more easy on something. I don't see how that would change my opinion if I was going to imagine myself in there or not, though. I don't see what else... Uh, so something that, like, oh, yeah. this movie's not scary at all, you're like, oh... oh and then, oh, like, not like, scary. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm very not concerned with how scary it is. I want it to be, like, good and interesting... And like, not not necessarily scary, but like more like what you're saying, where like things rattle around in my head for like a while. So like the premise and like the whatever of it. That's kind like of what I'm getting at. Me, is that uh, I like yeah, the concept the of it and stuff more like than that, necessarily yeah. the execution. Because I can see like, well, you were trying to do this. You didn't have the money to do that. You couldn't. Yeah. I'm like, but the writing was good. I'm like, that no, was like, interesting. I watch a lot of things almost like not not to like get ideas to steal them and then what the fuck do I even do with them? But like. I like to see the new, like, okay, how, you know, how does your thing work? How, how, you know, how, how do zombies work in your movie? How does this work? What happens? Yeah. Ooh, you got bit. Does that mean this? Oh, it means that. That's interesting. Like, I'm really, like, uh, into that sort of thing. So, yeah, this is like a gold mine for that shit where you have this box and this weird rules and timers and stuff like that. I want to know how this dude knows about the rules to, to, you know, to the extent that he does and just yeah, how this all, whole all thing works. Yeah, all things that are... Uh... Cause like once, hopefully explained. Because once he gives it away, is he done? Because why does he give a fuck at that point? Shouldn't 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 it just be well? It's, it, you know, it's out of my thing now, or whatever. Well, and once it kills a whole family, what like? How does it reset does to it reset? a new person? Is it whoever touches it like all of a sudden you're beamed the knowledge of what the box is? But again, all things that make me want to watch the movie to find oh, out that shit. So they say you can't destroy it. I I really like they show him here. He tries. It's on the grill. He's like trying to like do like a fucking handsaw on it and all that stuff. I like that because a lot of times, it, you know, they they like imply you can't destroy it, but they don't actually show the person like he should be up in like the attic, like like open the window, like fucking like throw it out and be like fuck you box. This is oh. Well, my like, thought is uh, like if I can't destroy it, what if I like. The thing that comes out of it, uh, what is it? Is it magical? Is it a thing? Can yeah. that thing die? Because they're all trying to kill it. If that can die, if I drop this to the bottom of the ocean, will it just drown? If I put it face down in fire, will it? Will the door open and it just burn to death? Yeah. If I, uh, you know, deprive it of oxygen, what will happen? Like, I, I just, yeah. But I like that they show him trying and that that's the reason why he's like, fuck. And I get the sense that, like, he's tried to throw it away and it, like, shows up again or something like yeah. that. That sort of thing. Probably. So there's an element of magical something or other. But I like that, and I really like, like, remember in Predator when he's like, like, sets his self destruct, and you see like all, all, like, it's this like countdown yeah. in like Predator language. This has a countdown, and and it's like a circular dial thing, but it has all these cool symbols on it, sure. and they're like glowing, and it's like the weird, like, oh, that's like two in ancient Mayan or whatever this is or something. Like, what? I dig weird, like, whatever. What do you think the definition of love is? Because if I, were, oh, yeah, if yeah. I hated somebody, right? But I, I'm like, he's gonna save my life by taking this box. There'd be a special place in my heart for that person. Right. It's it, it's like Groundhog Day. You just have to convince this person to love you, and, and every night and you're that, like, oh, I no, wonder the if that's tried in this. Yeah. Like, does he go visit some like you know like the the neighborhood jerk, give it to him, and it just pops back at his house? <laughs> right. Need to know. I hope so. 
because because there's a lot of things I would like I'd like to try. But again, if if you don't know how long that countdown really is, how many things can you even try before you have to be like, I have to be prepared. This shit's gonna happen like right now. Yeah, how does this end? Fucking probably grimly. I I I hope this ends darkly and it's like there's there is no escape, <laughs> whatever. Uh, and it's just like we're, the whole human race is fucked. Where'd this box come from? Ancient Who Mayans. Built it? That's th that's sort of what I'm f I'm feeling for some reason. I don't know why. Ancient right. something. So I think we both want to see this movie. Uh, yeah. I'm giving it a thumbs up. I think you are as well. Thumbs the fuck up and let's watch it actually. All right. So until next time, guys, don't die in a fire. We'll see you later and let us know what you think about uh. The, uh, what's what it was called? Fuck you. <laughs> Gremlin? I was going to say, okay. Did you I forget too? I, I, I knew until you were most of the way done with your sentence. Because I was like ready to spring it on. Like, I think he forgot because I closed the thing. This is hilarious. And then you could, like finished and I was like, <laughs> like I forget too. Now. <laughs> That yeah. was amazing. Gremlin. It's so... It, we even talked about it. Sure. Fuck them for taking I was Gremlin. I was picturing Gizmo. Like, what the fuck is his name? He's a... Uh, Mogwai? So enjoy, I was going to say, so enjoy... Mogwai? Fuck. Don't feed them after midnight unless you love a box. <laughs> Fucking what the... <laughs>